compared with Saab's Sensonic gearbox. Here's how it works. There is a gear stick, like you'd find in any normal manual car, but there's no clutch pedal because the clutch is operated automatically by the car's brain. Now, the idea is it's the best of both worlds. You get the control and precision of a manual gear change, but the easy life convenience of an automatic. And if you're just sort of driving about, as I am here, then it works perfectly well. However, it can be a bit problematic under certain circumstances. Aha! A space. And it is the one thing that the driver of a Sensonic Saab 900 fears the most. It's a reverse uphill parallel parking maneuver. And this is going to be a bit tricky. Just to increase my chances, I'll lower the roof. I'm just watching James May park a car. I suggest you all do the same. <laughs> it's always entertaining. Now, here is the issue. If this was a normal manual car, I'd be able to reverse, feeding the clutch very gently and very subtly to go backwards into the space. If it was an automatic, I'd put it in reverse, and the torque converter would, of course, make the car creep backwards. In this, when I take my foot off the brake, it will simply roll away. So, in reverse, no clutch, remember. Try and use the handbrake. There we are going backwards. But the instant you lift your foot a bit, the clutch disengages and does that, you see? You can't hold it like you can with a normal clutch. It isn't that sophisticated. Right, now let's try the parking maneuver. Of course, nobody is watching this, which makes it a lot easier. Are we struggling? Oh. No. I'm explaining to everybody the problem is that you can't park. No, the problem, oh, I'll explain it to you later. So, brake. Are we going backwards? I've got it. Feather it a bit. No, it's going to go forwards. No, it's going to go backwards. No, it's going to go backwards. This is quite good. It's going to go backwards. No, it's going to go backwards. No, it's rolling forwards. It's so difficult to do. Oh. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> so I'll try and give it a bit more revage. Then it, it does. <laughs> that is exactly the problem with a Sensonic Saab. You cannot get it into a parking space, can you? And then when you let your foot off the brake, because it doesn't have a creep function, it does that. Is that parked? Yeah! It's impossible. It's true, Saab's Sensonic gearbox was dreadful. But I've just thought of something worse. <laughs> <laughs>